And first at four today, we're following up on the four alarm fire at the Inn at Versailles that required more than a dozen fire departments help. Today, fire marshals and investigators were at the historic site working to determine the cause. Two News reporter Deborah Bogart has the latest on this developing story. Residents, guests, and nearby businesses just keep saying how crucial and historic this inn is to the village of Versailles, so they're elated that they will rebuild. The smell of smoke still lingers in downtown Versailles as the inn guests return to pick up their belongings. With sprinkler systems and all, and I had medication in my bag and my computer bag and stuff, and I was kind of worried about all that, but it all seems to be all right. He and other guests now staying at a conference center owned by Midmark Corporation, which also owns the inn at Versailles. Throughout the evening, the fire escalated. It did go into the walls, into the ceilings. Ken Demand with Midmark Corporation says power has since been restored to the rest of the block, and no injuries were reported as staff quickly evacuated the building of all inn and restaurant guests. He says it's too early to know the extent of the damage or cost of repairs, but says they have every intention of opening back up, which is exciting many residents who say it really draws people to the community. I have family come from California and uh, sister that comes from Vermont, and we like to eat here. So it's a very, very nice restaurant. Deborah Bogart, 2 News, working for you.